I feel like I'm all over the place. Soldier of Self Mastery here once again. Thank you for sticking around. I believe this might be video number four. We're gonna talk about, actually we started to get into this. We're gonna talk a little bit about electronic, electronic affirmations. I don't know if you can see my board, it's a little messy. And we're also gonna talk about facing your temptation head on. Now, again, I'm doing the best that I can to keep these videos short. I'm gonna continue to make every single day a super fantastic, terrific over the top day in spite of them because of today was one of those days where I just felt like blah. You ever, you ever get one of those days where you just feel like blah? You gotta pull out your old handy dandy positive uh, self-talk, man, and wind yourself up all over again, man. Thank God for positive self-talk. So, by the way, time is moving very quickly. I'm sure that you have noticed that. I'm gonna be 52 in October, and I say, my time is going by so quickly. And once we go through that door, I can remake my videos if I make a mistake, but, but our lives, right? <laughs> Once we go through that final door, it only opens up one way, my friend. Do you ever stop to think about that? The time that you have, what you're doing with your time? Now, I'm gonna say this once again. What I'm sharing in this video has worked for me. These are the life hacks that have transformed my life. Someone asked me, Santos, what do you do? How did you transform your life? Even though I've got a lot of videos that talk about these things you must be growing daily you must you must be you must know when you get out of bed and you do your deep breathing times three or you remind yourself of your affirmations that you've got memorized whatever they may be you must be growing every day you must feel in like you're in that state so let's get into this electronic affirmations now um, good old honest Abraham Lincoln, if you don't know who he is, he was one of our presidents, I don't know which one exactly, but he was back in the 1900s or 1800s, somewhere along there. They call him today good old honest Abe, of course he's on that piece of copper that we have called money. He said in order to create your future you must predict it. I believe it was like that. In order to create your future, you must predict it. You must bring your future into yourself and you must move yourself into your future. If you do not like the present person that you are right now, and if you don't like the present state that you're in, you can turn it all around, my friend. You can turn it all around. And that's what electronic affirmations is all about. Ele electronic affirmations is also subliminal. If you don't know what subliminal is, I would encourage you to Google that word, subliminal messaging. As a matter of fact, on my YouTube channel, you can, in the playlist, I have subliminal videos that I've listened to that I believe helped me along the way. You can check it out, do some homework and see how you feel about it, okay? It's all about you, my friend. So, you take a digital device, typically a phone, that's what I was, that's what I was using, and I would record my future state, right? I would take 10, 15 minutes and I would talk into that I had an Android phone and of course I was driving up and down the freeway so I had a lot of time to uh, listen to these recordings that I was creating and of course I would listen to them before I, I, I went to bed in the mornings when I got up. I was really excited about all this stuff because I just wanted to see what was going to happen and here I am today my friend. So this is very, this is life changing. It, it is life changing. It may not happen in, th in 30 days. It may not happen or you should be able to begin uh, sensing a shift in your mind and in your life within 30 to 60 days. If you're doing something, if you're reading a book, if you're journaling, if you're doing the positive, if you're watching video therapy, maybe even creating your own videos, put them on private and watch them yourself so you can see what, what you're saying and how you're thinking. I'm telling you, my friend, these are the things that have transformed. They've brought me away from problem gambling. They've given me strength. They've given me courage. They've given me uh, confidence out of the things that were, that were, I was entangled with. I was, I was being bound by those things. I didn't know that I could give myself permission to say no to things. Of course, you got to get yourself stronger, right? You got to scratch that record that's been playing in your head for so long. You gotta take that needle off. You gotta scratch the grooves. Of course, I talk about this in my book. Um, the great thing about this is when you get a consultant, you get a coach, you get a mentor, you get a therapist, of course, they're not gonna do the same things that I do. Okay, so if you need a great coach in your life, I would encourage you, connect. My information will be below this video. I'll help you get through these things faster if you find some kind of an enjoyment in these videos. That's what a coach will do. A coach will actually help you 
achieve your goals. Okay, it's not about, it's not going to be my plan, it's going to be your plan. So record your future state, right? You record it in a digital device. It used to be you could record it in a, a cassette or something. And all you're doing is you're, you're basically recording a 10, a 5, 10, 15 minute uh, message. I remember I used to do them in segments and I had several messages. And in those messages, I was using I am statements. I am. I am, uh, for example, I am very patient. I am very strong. I am very smart against temptation. I am a great leader. I am a person that's going to help many people around the world. I remember saying those things, and I would, there was a lot. I mean, you can get real personal with your own message. And believe me, your voice carries. Your voice will move you because your brain knows your voice more than anybody else's voice. So you're, you're basically talking, you're talking into a message the opposite of who you want of who you are today and then you're just basically listening to the heck listening you're pumping that into your brain my time's going by very quickly and that's all I did I found ways to listen to it in my car when I was driving you know with my little earbud I would listen to that message over and over and over when I got home even if I was tired getting ready to go to bed I would put that little message in the morning when I woke up five or ten minutes boom I was listening I did that as much as possible of course along with all the other life hacks that I was doing and it'll take you, my friend. It will take you to another level. I, I guarantee it. It's happened in my life. You know, I'm living the person that I, I, I would write about. Today, I'm living the person that I would write about and record myself as. But you got to, you know, as, as if you're already there. You record the statements as if you're already there. I am a whatever, whatever. Um... I remember Zig Ziglar, Zig Ziglar, Jim Rohn, Anthony Robbins, and many others, they talk about turning your automobile into a university, a mobile university. So it's up to you what you do with your time. It's up to you, my friend. I'll stop there. And the other thing that I want to talk about is you got to be willing to face your temptation, okay? Believe me, this is going to, this is going to build confidence. This is going to build courage. This is going to be, help you become more creative. I was not the person, you look at me four or five or six years ago, I was a whole different person. In fact, I'm different than I was yesterday. So you got to face your temptation, my friend. You got to be willing to go through the struggle. Don't run from the struggle. Don't run. Many people are procrastinating, right? New Year's resolutions type people, right? They make their resolutions and then they run from them a week later or two weeks later. Why? Because it gets hard. You got to be willing... You've got to be willing to go through the struggle, my friend. All of these things can prepare you to face your struggle, face your temptation. Instead of buckling, instead of letting your knees crumble when you face temptation, no, now you're looking at temptation head on and you're saying, I'm going to deal with you, temptation. I am going to deal with you because I have the ability. Okay? So that is big. Obviously, until you're willing to do this, you're not going to climb that mountain that's in front of you, my friend. Until you're willing to face your temptation, your struggle, it's going to be painful in the beginning, but then it'll be downhill, okay? It will be downhill. And this is life. This is life. You can't keep running from that temptation. You cannot keep running from it. Maya, I didn't want to keep this video as long as I have. I'm going to end here, my friend. I'll see you on the last video. Thank you for being a part of this audience. And again, my information will be below if you want to connect with me. Share these videos, comment, subscribe if they make sense to you, my friend. And once again, I'm believing for a breakthrough in your life. Soldier of self-mastery, peace with strength.